We've all been in this situation. Late at night, you stop at an intersection because of a red light. You immediately notice you are alone at this intersection, and yet the opposing direction has a green light. You become impatient and frustrated, thinking to yourself, whoever designed the system is an idiot. My name is Wade Genders. I'm from civil engineering, and I can solve this problem by engineering some intelligence into our traffic lights. It's first worth considering, what is intelligence? Like any interesting question, there isn't a definitive answer yet. Humans are intelligent, at least we think we are. Some of us are. Other animals appear to exhibit varying levels of intelligence. But do machines? Are computers intelligent? The answer is they are starting to be. A discipline known as machine learning is giving computers intelligence, allowing them to, to perform complex tasks that would otherwise be very difficult through traditional computing methods. Modern society relies on its transportation systems to be efficient. However, increasing demand on these systems has produced congestion, delays, and unnecessary emissions. The problem is that some elements of the current transportation system use relatively old and outdated methods. Using machine learning, we could improve some of these old elements, such as traffic lights, give them intelligence, and that would alleviate some of the problems that I've outlined. OK, so how do I go about creating intelligent traffic lights? Consider, how do humans learn a new skill? They train, they practice, initially making mistakes, but quickly recognizing their errors and correcting their behavior until they become proficient. I do the same with intelligent traffic lights. I simulate thousands of hours of traffic in a computer to allow the traffic lights to practice changing in order to learn how to achieve some goal. In this case, reducing vehicle delay. Once training has been completed, the traffic lights have been successful in learning how to reduce vehicle delay meaning that you and I will never be stuck at a late night red light ever again. That's how the traffic lights learn, but what exactly is it that is doing the learning? This is where things get interesting. Again, ask yourself, what do humans use to learn a new skill? As far as body parts go, the brain is pretty important for humans to learn. The intelligent traffic lights are actually controlled by an artificial brain, something known as an artificial neural network. Artificial neural networks are inspired by brains and are essentially mathematical functions that process information. So far, my intelligent traffic lights have been able to reduce vehicle delay by one-fifth, a promising result. And continuous developments in machine learning may still yield further improvements. At the intersection of computer science and biology, I think machine learning is an exciting field. And ideally, it will keep you and I from waiting around at real intersections in the future. Thank you.